Uh, just a little bit of ex explanation about a pending project for that electric underbill. Do you want to explain that, Bill? REC electric underbill? They started last Thursday. T&D Construction, they got the bid from SAC REC. And I, I talked to the foreman. He thought they'd be done by Christmas. It's on two miles of line. And this is all FEMA approved line. About, two, about six customers on that line, six or seven. Just the beginning of the FEMA project. So on, on this line, say it's about two miles. Uh, it is approved for FEMA reimbursement for SAC REC and, and for us. Okay? So we've used, SAC REC has done all the bidding on that and done, used all of the proper procedures to make sure that it remains FEMA eligible. We've been working kind of along on the side on this too to, to make sure that we're involved with this too. So we will be billed directly from, from T&D Construction for our share of the cost. Now our share just is um, basically that underbuilt part, and we do not have a share of the poles, other than the fact that we have a few poles on there that are exclusive to us. Right, Bill? Right. But if they're shared poles, we don't have a responsibility on poles. When do we get FEMA reimbursement? Is that going to be a two-year process? That's the other good thing about this, because I'm not really sure what the what the answer is, but this is a, a small project to get it started and it will allow us to work through the FEMA reimbursement process and, and uh, kind of get a feel for exactly how that works. Did we decide how we're going to be funded for that? Are we doing local banks? Or? Just that we know the local banks are interested. You know, I haven't, I haven't talked to interest rates with them or anything like that.